armed robber accidentally shoots gang member while escaping after operation. A member of an armed robbery gang met his Waterloo as residents of Amarada suburb of Yenagoa, the Bales state capital, mobbed him to death after dispossessing customers of a popular supermarket of their valuables. The dead member of the robbery gang, identified as the driver of the getaway tricycle popularly known as Keek Napep, was accidentally shot in the back by one of his colleagues, who was aiming at the mob chasing them. At about 9 p.m. on Monday, the four-man robbery gang arrived at the popular supermarket located along the Mgbi Road, and raided the few customers present by collecting mobile phones and cash realized from sales for the day. However, things went south for the robbers, when some youth seated across the supermarket noticed their attempt to escape. They pelted the robbers with bottles despite gunshots fired to scare people away. It was also gathered that despite the gunshots fired by the fleeing robbers, the angry mob chased after them and caused the fleeing tricycle to collide with a stationary car along the street. An eyewitness who identified himself as Chinadu said, in the process of colliding with the car, the tricycle somersaulted and we heard another gunshot. Later, we discovered that one of the robbers loaded guns went off and hit the tricycle driver on the back. Three of the robbers escaped, while the tricycle driver attempted to escape with gunshot wound but was chased to the back of First Bank in the area and he was handed over to the police. Evangelist Parkinson he cried, chairman of the Bales Estate Vigilante Service, and the State Police Public Relations Officer, DSP Asinambuswat, confirmed the development. Meanwhile, Joseph Mippen, the State Commissioner of Police, has held a consultative meeting with the leadership of the State Vigilante Service and the Bailsa Volunteer Force on Monday, over the rising cases of cold killings and armed robbery incidents. McN assured the youth of a new order and the operations of the police command in the state with needed protection for the identity of those that supply information to the police and the diligent prosecution of those caught with firearms and involved in violent crimes. He also expressed concern over the quick release of arrested suspects from police custody, stating that it is disheartening to hear that suspects caught will be on the streets under 24 hours. Such acts will not be condoned except they are released by the court. Our approach will be total. During my tenure, the law will be allowed to take its full course, he said. <laughs>